What is up, Motivation Theory family? I got a run in. I got a run in this week. Uh, having to travel to see my father for a surgery. I didn't think I was going to be able to, but I'm in the, I guess the half, the half of a seven mile run. It's nice and cool. It's about 50 degrees, sunny, not raining sideways like it was last night. But anyways, I'm walking up this huge hill. So it's a good, it's a good breaking point here to talk to you. Um, so in the last week five, let's do a week five update. I think I got in five hours um, of exercise again. I have messed around with Strava again. I got subscribed again. Um, I'm in there adjusting things. I'm having issues with my um, Sunto 2 watch and the syncing software with that with Strava. I'm sure many of you have probably dealt with that. Um, so that's kind of a pain. So I'm dealing with that. So I am motivation theory on Strava. So if you want to look that up, send me a request. What else? Um, feeling good, guys. I'm down about 13 pounds and I'm starting to feel like a runner. I'm nowhere near my fitness level before, but it's getting there. It's getting there. I'm doing this slowly and smartly to stay healthy and not injure myself. That's the goal. Um, this 24 hour race that's coming up is not going to be probably my uh, PR and I'm fine with that. Starting off again, I just want to make sure that I'm able to not have any breaks because of injury and, uh, and to have fun. I definitely miss running ultras a lot. Um, so this is going to be fun for me. I'm having a blast. Um, it's humbling um, coming out to these areas and Strava reminding me like this was not your best effort <laughs> in comparison to some, of the, to some of my old uh, times and a lot of the routes I run, which is kind of funny. Thanks, Strava. Make a guy feel good. Um, so progress. I'm right where I need to be. I think midway through February, I'm going to ramp it up a little bit more, start doing a little more speed work, slight increase, slight increase, not getting crazy. Just trying to uh, get my body used to, my lungs used to uh, going a little faster. Believe me, I want to do some tempo runs and stuff like that, but it just isn't worth it. The juice is not worth the squeeze right now to do something that's going to hurt me. So. Uh, Week five is going good. I'm in week six right now. I think this is my second run for the week. So when I'm done with this, I'll probably be about two and a half hours for the week. Today is Thursday. I'm gonna be traveling Friday and uh, or Saturday. Is today Friday? I don't know what day it is, guys. It's crazy. I think today's Friday. Whew. It's been a crazy last week for me. Crazy last week. And thank you for uh, for all the well wishes for my father. He's doing good, really sore, as can be expected when you get your chest cracked open. So, um, everything's good though, it's good. So I'm happy, that stress has kind of subsided and uh, I feel like I can go back home and uh, get back to my, uh, my life, training, family, and not be so worried about my father. Whew. This hill's getting ready to crest and go back downhill, so let me wrap this up. Um, again, thank you all for the support. I'm doing well. Um, two videos that are going to be coming this next week. I'm excited about those. They won't be updates. Um, this is an update. You guys rock, and I hope all of your training is going well. Oh, before you go, don't click off the video yet. Um, there's a couple other things that I'm doing right now with training. I got a uh, standing desk at work, so I stand all day. That's one of the key things in ultras, time on your feet. So even if you're a little under trained, if you're able to spend eight to 12 hours on your feet all day, that's a, that's a good step right there. Even if you're, um, your fitness isn't there. So I'm standing all day. I'm walking a lot more. I'm taking the steps everywhere. Everything that I can do to kind of put myself in a better spot, this, this dude, I'm doing. And standing all day is actually helping a lot with my back and my feet. So my feet don't hurt at all on my runs now. And typically that will happen when you're starting off running. So it's 
key tip there. If you can get a standing desk and spend most of the day on your feet, you'll be in a good spot. Um, if you're gonna be coming into any kind of ultra or race in, in any form, like a half marathon or marathon, you're gonna be in a lot better spot. Uh, all right, guys, I'm gonna take off. I'll see you in the next video. If you are not subscribed, please do so. And if you're not caught up on my videos, go catch up before I start releasing new ones. Go catch up. Thanks, guys. I will talk to you later. Bye.